I'm Dr. Amy Thompson, and I'm wondering if you're aware that Kingston and the surrounding areas is an endemic area for both ticks and Lyme disease that they carry. So one main part of preventing ticks and thus the transmission of Lyme disease is using a product to prevent the attachment and biting of ticks, and today we're going to discuss canine advantix. They, it's a topical medication that is applied to your pet's skin, absorbed through the skin, and it's all based on weight. So we have multiple different sizes depending on your dog's weight. Advantix is designed to be applied once monthly with occasional bathing and swimming not affecting the product. However, if your pet is an avid swimmer, it's recommended to discuss with your veterinarian increasing the frequency of which we're applying. It's going to come in a package similar to this. When you remove the foil packaging, there are going to be six individual doses in there. The individual doses which will look much like this in a foil um, package. You want to pop the individual vial out. It's going to come out like this. This vial is sealed, so it's very important to remove the lid, turn it around and use the top of the lid to perforate it, and then you're set to apply as simple as that. So I want to talk a little bit more specifically about the product, Canine Advantix. So pictured here is one of the main ticks we can find on our dogs. So Advantix, as the name implies, protects against ticks. It also protects against fleas. One thing that we should mention at this point is when using Advantix, you should speak to your veterinarian about pairing it with an oral medication that will also protect your pet against intestinal parasites as well as heartworm, as this medication does not do that. Another important thing we dis should discuss about Canine Advantix is that it is only made for canines and should not be used on our cats at home. The other important thing is to keep Piper or your dog at home once it's been applied away from our feline friends for at least 12 hours between application. Unlike other topical products, Advantix, once absorbed into the skin, remains in the skin. So it's very important that we apply it in more than one spot to help distribute the medication all over our dog's body. So what we do is part the hair at the base of the neck, start applying, and continue to apply all the way along his back to make sure it's distributed all the way along. So, I hope that you've gotten enough information as far as tick prevention goes. If you have any further questions, I advise you speak to your veterinarian. And you can also speak to them about other ways of protecting your pet against these pesky pests and the diseases they carry. Thank you.